Oh, but we're getting trade points here with Franklin. And can Dr. Steven. I, so, Frank, what is it you discovered you can uh, do? Ax, ax, actually, no, I, I, knew, I knew I could do it. I was just like, I was surprised when it happened. Because uh, well, I actually don't have the screen that got bigger. Oh, yeah, yeah. Just... I mean, I knew you could do that. It just cut me off guard for a second because I don't, I don't usually do that. So what's weird on the iPhone 11, in addition to the fact that there is no home button, mm -hmm. like literally none, you tap the screen and slide up. Mm -hmm. um, the other fun little number on this is that you can actually adjust the screen size with your fingers. Mm. Really? Yeah. So, like, you can have it full screen, half screen, whatever the heck you want. I mean, I... I mean, I think you can do it in some apps with the iPhones, just... But, do you, like, do it, like, all time, or is it just... For select apps? Uh... I think for anything you're watching the video on, or if you're actually filming as well. I, I think you can do it with any iPhone. Because I do it with my iPhone 6. Nick, <laughs> you, you, you didn't have an iPhone 6, you had an iPhone 10. I had an 8. Oh, yeah, an 8. 11. Yeah, you, 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 skipped, you skipped three generations to get, the, to get the last one. Look at me, I'm such a hacker. <laughs> such a hack hacker. <laughs> that's, more, that's more ignoring that 9, 10 don't exist, you just want to trade to 11. Is there even a 9? I think there, I think there was, but no one, no one remembers it. It's like no one remembers the iPhone 8, or 10, or 7, or 6, uh, or 5. On a the 8 is fairly well remembered. Yeah, but not much realistic here. Once it's past generation, you're not going to remember it. 5, 7, 4, and 9, and 1 and 2 and all that junk are not remembered. I'd say... Uh, four, six. 8, 11, and the ones. Hmm. Alright, time to face the final boss of this, uh, this, ga this galaxy. Yeah, it's, yeah, it's only like five bosses. This dog just standing in the main. I can't see, Penny. Actually, yeah. <laughs> what, 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 come here and make out of that, Stephen. I, I'm not. It was just some guy took a picture of it standing in the train track. Oh, so speaking of which, Steven, I'm actually quite happy for the Browns now. They yes, finally... Freddy Kitchens is going. Yeah, they finally did the one thing everybody wanted to do. In addition to the one thing that people probably didn't want him to do... What? What? Nick Chubb's still in Cleveland. No, 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 no. John Dorsey. Oh, yeah, John Dorsey. <laughs> That's what I was going to say. Yeah, I know. We're Cleveland Browns fans of sound life. Think about that. Back in the 60s, the Browns were the Patriots, okay? Think about that. But that was in the 60s before Super Bowl era. Which, here, like, with, with great players like Jim Brown and the likes. Ow! I swear, if I died as a boss, after all of that. You serious? There we go. Jeez, he's dead now. There you go. Now, we're gonna do it again. Right. What? Yo, yo. Yo, yo. Alright, so uh, Christmas is just passed, so tell us yours. What was your favorite gift? Mine is the thing Steven's sitting on. The new gaming chair. How do you like that, folks? Frank's <laughs> favorite Christmas gift is this, and I'm sitting on it. You, but I also like... Isn't that just the utmost disrespect? <laughs> I, also, I also have the Pokemon Shield game. I mean, I, I had a fun time playing through it. But, Steven, I'd probably, probably be getting you to do for a channel, Pokemon Shield. Yeah. It's relatively easy to understand a game. What's up, the group? Oh, see, it's your character. Oh. Looks like a green one falling back. Don't see those fellers often. I bet he's got some interesting tales to tell. Why don't you say hello? I didn't know I was level 1 British here for a second. Yeah, I don't <laughs> know what happened there. <laughs> Alright, let's continue going on. We still got more galaxies and stuff to like to do. Ow. No, don't talk about that. Alright. There was, was there a comment star on this one? Oh no, they decided to hold off on that one. Anyway, it's time to go feed our last Larry Luma. Toof! 
thousand? Holy crap, he's hungry. Steve, you like imagining. Steve, can you imagine like eating 2,000 pieces of candy? That'd be a lot of sugar. <laughs> eh, he already told us that log. <laughs> Just... Alright, let's let's go talk to the toad bank. Who's our bank toad? The happy bank. The happy bank. Uh, and my throat wasn't scratched right now, I'll probably do toad voice when I'm like, but my throat hurts. <laughs> ah, it's better nothing. What, what video is that? That's the wheeling my rail I just took a video of. Oh yeah, uh, soon to be uploaded to Ravenna Real Fan 47. Yeah, Steven Pell records so you know, that's that from, from my backyard. Yep. That wasn't for me. I'm waiting to catch an actual train here, though. Speaking of which, very last Tuesday we like woke up and like five yeah. o'clock in the morning. So last week, Josh and I went to see Rise of Skywalker. We all, we all, we all did. And I spent the night at Frank's, and at five fifty-five in the morning, <laughs> we link six six three wakes us up. And because it was so early in the morning and dark, I didn't think I'd get a good shot, and it was too lazy to chase the train, <laughs> only to find out. That it had the bicentennial unit, and then I'm like, oh, kill myself. I wanted that. <laughs> I remember. Uh, the funny thing was, well, that, that night, it wasn't the train that woke me up. It was you bickering about it. Oddly enough. Really? Yeah, it was. <laughs> it's like... I mean, maybe maybe because I slept here a long time on train blurry in the background, I got used to it. You, you heard me like talking about it. Yeah, I heard you talking about it. That pulled me up. Cause I think in my dream I had a train in the background. I was like, oh, it's probably it's part of part of the dream. Well, it's probably part of the dream. <laughs> my brain my brain thinks of weird things sometimes. Are you you should have heard the one dream my mom said she had the other night. Really? Yeah. Apparently, like. There was some American girl named Amy who got kidnapped in Mexico. What? And inside this grand, like, Catholic cathedral, there are these choir boys singing about her kidnapping, and it was really strange. Wait a second. Hold on. Did he actually did that? Yeah. <laughs> no, it's not an actual <laughs> thing. She just dreamed about it. Oh, okay. I was like going to say, like, really? That is a bizarre dream. What? No, it was an actual dream. It just didn't happen in real life. Was that was that the sound of the train yelling? <laughs> no, the train yelling. Well, okay, I'm, I'm Elon meant the train horn. So, uh, JIWI2000 who does these pretty awesome model train mm -hmm. reviews. Check him out, viewers. Uh, Go check him out. He had this kind of. It wasn't a meme, but it was just like a little blooper clip he uploaded this morning, mm -hmm. and he had. One of the HO scale uh, General Electric test train engines, mm -hmm. and he's like, "You're such a nice looking locomotive. Why couldn't you get along with the other kids?" <laughs> and uh, then he's like, "Oh, hey guys, didn't realize the camera was on." <laughs> <laughs> That's a clip for the ages. Mm -hmm. an animate that. Animate that. <laughs> Such a nice looking look. You would have been great for my layout. Why couldn't you get along with the other kids? No. Oh, I'm sorry, Dad. I try. <laughs> Not trying hard enough. <laughs> but, the, but the kids just keep calling me Small Loco. I'm not sure what it means, but... Small Loco. <laughs> I'm not sure what that means, but it, it's very it's very derogatory towards me. I Why? Like. Are you a big Loco? <laughs> it's like, like imagine... I can imagine like big lo like big locomotives just like dis like discriminate all the small ones. <laughs> <laughs> if trains could talk, it probably happened. <laughs> it's like some sort of small locomotive rights movement. Small locomotive rights movement. Wait, 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 wait! I just thought of something really bad. So like a lot of steam engines are mostly or completely black. Uh -huh. And there's a lot of diesels that are colored in different paint schemes, you know. Uh -huh. So, so the uh, the diesels discriminate against the steam engines because. Okay, we'll stop there. Please. We're just gonna stop there. Uh, oh, 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 okay. 
Don't ask for many don't ask for many choices, it's called close calls. Get it? That's the timer. Oh it is? Oh we're almost on this. That tribal thumping you hear, yeah. We are almost done with we are almost done with this. We've got the star is why did it just stop midair? Is it gets me the game trip in Hall Franklin? <laughs> and King Dark Steve. Yeah, see you out in the game rail. Goodbye.